everyone. Is there anybody here? <laughs> Trying to get this straight again. <laughs> I don't know if anybody's here, if anybody can see me. <clears throat> Hi, Jaxi, it's here. Hi, Michelle. Is it Michelle? Tina, hi Squirrel Ray, Karen, hi love, hi Melly, Judy, hi Laura, hi Sin, because Amy, hi honey, Carrie, hi, hi Danny, thank you all for coming, sorry I couldn't be here yesterday, we had my son's wedding so it was kind of a crazy day, so. I didn't get home in time to do my live, so I figured I'll just wait till today. I'm trying to get the camera in a good position. It's tough. Squirrel Raid! Hi, Fat Dancer! Crystal! Poppin' Princess is here! Yay! Hi, Wanda! Madonna, my queen! Yay, my queen is here! Hi, Nan. How are you, honey? I want to miss any Sharon. Hugs, 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 Sharon. Love you, honey. Yeah, I was looking up, trying to get ready, and I'm not used to going on at this time. This is early for me. It's usually 3 o'clock, so I was like, oh my God, that time was getting away from me. But, so I kind of just jumped in Granny G's. Oh, Shan, my pearl is here. I know. I only wear them on Friday, but I didn't do Friday, so I put them on today. <laughs> I got my pearls for Jan. I got my magic wand for Jaxi. Wand of twins. Magic wands. Up, up, up. Okay, hello everyone from D's. Bright headed and bright eyed and bushy tailed. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> bright eyed and bushy tailed. <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> okay, I have <laughs> lots of yarn <laughs> to unbox. We went to my son's wedding yesterday and I had stayed there for a month right when COVID hit. So while I was there, you know, shopping and having Jan come in and I had a bunch of Jan stash there that Papa Swift didn't know about. <laughs> so yesterday after the wedding, we went to the kids' apartment just for a little while. Um, they didn't have anyone else over, so I wasn't too worried about COVID and all that because that was my big thing was I didn't want to go near people, you know. I'm trying to stay safe because of the baby coming in January, so... Anyway, so while we were there, I figured I'd grab all my yarn out of their house and bring it here. So Papa Swift made six trips up and down the stairs, I think. <laughs> I didn't even realize I had had that much there. So it's all here. We're going to do an unboxing mystery. I have no idea what was there. I haven't opened any of it. So I figured we'll do it together. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> but I do have a couple things to show you. I've been working on Phoenix the sequel. It's right here. Getting there. I had, um, last week I, when I sh went on, I had just gotten the white, the cream yarn in, because T ordered it for me, our lovely Teresa Patton. So I hadn't started with the cream yet, so I did. I started putting the cream in it, and I love it. I think it looks so cool. So I'm up to here right now, but yeah. So it's going to be just the blue and the cream, and I think it's gorgeous. I love it. Not just because, you know, but it real the colors, I'm really happy with the colors together. So that's it right now. So I'm up to, I think, round 39 or 40, something like that. So, yeah, I think it's 39 or 40. I don't know. But I really like the two colors together. It reminds me of, um, like, an old-fashioned cameo. That light, that antique blue and the cream, I think it's really pretty. So... I'm just hoping it's going to be a Christmas gift and I hope the recipient will like it because, you know, when you make something for someone else, you want to hope, you hope they like it. So I think it's pretty, but we'll see. Oops. Okay, and I worked on a few more of the squares for my Christmas, Christmas afghan that I'm doing. Nothing fancy. Thank you, Madonna. Thank you, my queen. Okay, I think I had showed you. I don't remember. I don't remember what I showed you. Because I had left it at home because we were in the park and I could only bring so many things. 
I know I showed you these, the medieval granny squares. Yeah, I had done a white and a the burgundy and the green in that. So I got those three done. That was already last week. I did three willow squares. So I did the white and the burgundy and the green in the willow squares. I like the willow squares, they're pretty. So I did those. And I did because of my friend. Hi, Donna Marco. How are you, honey? I don't want to miss anybody. Michelle. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Olivia. If you're there, sweetheart. Okay, because of um, Teresa Pat and our Granny Square Queen, I had to do grannies. So I did a white and a burgundy and a green in the in the in the in the regular grannies. And I did the V stitch grannies. I did again one of each and just the V stitch granny. So I did those. And then I did the circle in the square. I think it's cool. It's just something different, you know. So I did one of each of those. So that's where I'm at with that. Hi D, hi love. Thank you for coming, sweetie. Sorry, I had to cut out of yours soon. Early, I, I had to get ready. I'm not used to going on at this time. I know you are. Because you do it different times on Saturday and Sunday, but I'm not used to it. So it's like, oh my God, time's getting away from me. I got to get moving. <laughs> so that's that. My Christmas afghan I've been working on. That was pretty much it. I kind of, that's kind of all I've done, I think. Except, you know, working on the Phoenix. So I got that done. So what else? What else we got? I don't even know. I don't even know. I'm so unorganized today. It's crazy. Okay. Sharon's fundraiser. I, again, I'm blown away, but I'm not shocked because everyone is just amazing. Amazing! As of yesterday, yesterday, last night, we were up to $2,590. So, I may as well call it $2,600. I... I'm thrilled. I'm so happy. Everybody, everyone's been so great. And we have 20 prizes now. 20! 20 prizes! They're coming in from everywhere. People have been amazing. I don't remember where we were at the last update. Hmm. I think we were at 14 maybe. I don't know. But we're at 20 now. So... Get your tickets if you haven't gotten any yet because this is going to be huge. So we're going to do the drawing on Thanksgiving, 3 o'clock my time, 3 o'clock Pacific, my regular time that I normally go on. I know it's going to be a strange day for everyone because of the holiday and it's kind of a weird year. So I figured we'll do it 3 o'clock. Hi, Cindy. How are you, honey? Oh, Cindy Lillard. I need to tell you about Cindy Lillard. She's amazing. She's an amazing lady. Cindy had purchased a hundred dollars worth of tickets the very first week last week she purchased another hundred and said to put the tickets in Sharon's name how do you my god so you know what this is what this community is like and I can't thank her enough I can't thank all of you enough I don't care if you bought one ticket it means just as much because every dollar adds up and look where we're at. It's unbelievable. It's, it's just great. Mr. Random. Hi, Mr. Random. Do you craft? D says, I forgot to tell you to, you forgot to do what? I forgot to email you, Trish, about me donating. Pinko, yeah, you, yeah, email me, please, D, because if I don't get the email, I, I want to keep it all straight. So just even a, you know, quick, please. Thank you. I appreciate that, honey, though, so much. Oh, everyone, I know Sharon, right? I mean, I, it's, it's amazing. It's amazing. <laughs> oh, my granny square. Hi, honey. Hi there, everyone. Hi, granny D and everyone else. Judy. I need his crochet ideas. Okay, be right back. Okay, be right back. Go ahead. <laughs> Hi, Ursula. Oh, Cindy, you've done so much. Don't, you know, and like I say, I'm, I'm just pointing out because, and I don't want to do that, but I asked her if it was okay if I could mention it because people have sent me anonymous donations and I'm keeping them anonymous. 
You're not getting it out of me. There's no way. People trust me. I'm going to keep their trust. But I asked Cindy if it would be okay because I just wanted everyone to know what she what she did for sharing. Yep, $2,590, Crystal. So we may as well call it $2,600 because, you know, we'll round it up. <laughs> I'm not going to worry about that. Sharon's going to get an even amount. But I'm, we got we got we got a few more days. We got, what, today's Saturday? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. We got five more days because we're going to end it um, Wednesday night. 11.59 my time. So that's Pacific time. So you got time. Get the word out. If everyone here who has a channel just does a little shout out, just a five minute, four minute, two minute little thing, that would be so great. Because every time someone has shouted it out on their channel, I get more emails. We sell more tickets and it's all about selling tickets and getting money in for sharing. So if everyone could just take a minute and I would appreciate it so much and I know she would too. So, yeah, that would be great. That's my challenge this week. If you could just do a little, you know, quick video if you have content on your channel. If you don't have content, do a quick video anyway. That could be your first video. It would be great. What a great reason to start doing video on your channel. Yep. Yep. Sharon saying thank you to all for your help. You are amazing from my heart. Yeah, it's all about Sharon. She's got a special place in my heart so we love her so much she's such a sweet lady so yeah yeah all right you want to do some unboxing you want to see what I had at my son's house because I have no idea <laughs> it's kind of crazy <laughs> I don't know where to start all right let's start up here hey <laughs> what's we got what's we got we got, I think this is all bits and bobs. Yep, bits and pieces. This one's bits and pieces. Oh, there's leftovers from this afghan. <laughs> this is a queen size chevron um, single crochet. Took forever. I called it the beast when we were, when I was making it. It's crazy. But this is leftovers from it. <laughs> so that's what's in this box. There's a bunch of leftover yarn. A lot of stuff I can use for an afghan. We got some leftover this. <laughs> Some leftover yellow. <laughs> you never know when you start looking through stuff what you had left. Oh, look, little bits of leftovers. Because Mama Swift don't play that way. I don't get rid of any of it. None of it. None of it. I keep it all because scrap cans are great. The charity that I donate to, they love getting scrap cans. They don't care. Oh, look, a little tiny bit of purple. <laughs> I know. Well, this looks like something I started. We'll have to see what that is. I have to take a minute and open that bag later. See what that is. Bunch of labels. I don't know why I keep labels. That's silly. More labels. <laughs> oh, some Premier Basics in white. What a shock that I would have Premier Basics. Huh? Any yarn is good. Leftover or not. That's right. I use it all. I don't care. So we got some Premier Basics in white. That always comes in handy. All right, what else we got? We got some Mandela Tweed. Mandela Tweed stripes in Wishbone. Oh, I know what I used this for. This was from Lisa's Afghan that I made her for her fairy gift. When we, when you guys all did the fairy um, videos when you were doing the Christmas in July fairies. Well, I did a contest for people to vote on their favorite, well, their most creative fairy who put up a, a video. And Lisa got the most votes, so I made her an afghan. I made her um, a custom afghan, one of a kind. And this is what I used for it. So, yeah. Oh, yes, I also don't throw yarn away. I like to respect it too much. Only throw about what I really, really have to cut up. Yeah, I don't even throw those away. I keep them all in a bag, and I use the little cutoffs to stuff yamagurumis. I don't throw nothing away. Yarn is sacred. We don't throw yarn away. So that's what I had left from Lisa's Afghan. <laughs> Oop, another little piece. <laughs> okay, we got some blue and some blue and green. That Afghan's over there. Maybe we'll see that one next week. I don't know. But yeah, I had four or five Afghans at my son's house that I had made while I was there. So they were all stacked up in the closet, so I brought them all home. So we'll start doing more giveaways. So this is the navy blue and the green. Yeah. Yeah, that's what that yarn is. It's that Go Team. The Go Team. 
in the blue and green Dubber Normal every day. I got this on clearance and it was really inexpensive, so I got a bunch of it and I said, I'll figure out what I'm gonna do with it. And I ended up using it for an afghan and it came out really good. So, oh, another Navy Blue Basics. That's always good. Let's see, I don't know what this is. No idea what this is. There's no label, there's no nothing. It looks like Karen Cakes. I think it might be Karen Cakes. Let's see. Yep, Karen Cakes and Mixed Berries. So that's leftover from another afghan that I made. Lots of leftovers in here. Okay, that's that box. <laughs> that's one down. That's a little one though. No, never throw yarn away. That's awful. That's right, Karen. Scraps. I don't care what size they are. I keep them. I use them. I'll use them. I'll use them. I'll mix them in with something else. And I have no problem mixing yarns like some people I know. I made ornaments with all the bias. Bits I cut from yarn and put all the bits in a clear ball ornament. Oh, that's so cool. That's a good idea, Cindy. I like that idea. That would be cool. Yanni people would appreciate that. Okay, that's one box. I may as well put all these labels back. I don't know why I kept all these labels, all these labels. <laughs> I think Madonna mentioned it once. I don't know. I listen to everything my queen says, you know, so. I think she had mentioned once, try and keep all your labels for one year and see how many you use. But I would have a box full, so, because I go through a lot of here. <laughs> so I don't think I'll keep them. I think I'll just throw them out. If she wants them, I'll send them to her. If you want all my labels, Madonna, I'll send them to you, honey. I don't know why she'd want them, but. All right, let's grab another box. This box came straight from Premier and went right in the closet. So I have no idea what's in it. It's a big one though. I think it's a bunch of, ooh. ooh, sweet rolls. Whole bunch of sweet rolls, yay. Okay, we got sweet rolls. Lots and lots of sweet rolls. We got pink and purple ones. I got three, four of those. I got four of each, I think. Yeah, there's four of each. Wow. Okay, this is, let's see. Color is raspberry swirl. Pretty. So I got one, two, three, four of those. We got purple. Now purple is called grape swirl. Grape swirl. Got four of those in there. I got the blue one. <laughs> That's crazy. Papa Swift's outside. I'm like, you stay outside, I'll be fine. Um, Blueberry swirl, pretty blueberry. We got, let's see, this one is, let's see. Silver swirl, got four of those. And what's this one? This one is black pepper swirl. I got four of those. Lots of sweet rolls. Yay! They must have been like three for ten or something because, you know, when they go on sale like that, you can't pass it up. So, oh, there's more yarn in here. Okay, we got Premier Basics. In, I think this might be Colored Royal. Color Royal Blue, I think. Royal Blue. We got three of those. Nice. And we got... Three more Premier Basics, and I think this is just called black. Charcoal. Supposed to be charcoal gray. It looks black to me. I don't know. Yeah, maybe it's charcoal gray. So I got three of those in that box. And look, T, there's some red. Three red. What a shock that I would have red yet. <laughs> okay, we got three color is red. Red. That's it. I got three of those in that box. Good box. <laughs> I like that box. So that was a good one. I got a big one over there. I got from Harshness too. I have no idea what's in that one. Don't even remember. No clue. This is great. It's like getting all brand new yet. Hi Ingrid, how are you honey? T, your marvelous red is beautiful. Isn't it beautiful? We'll have to come up with something cool for that, that red. Well, I got all my squares, so maybe I'll get that done. All right, let's see if I can get this out of the way. Got 
too much stuff in the way in here. You have 84. What to make? Oh, your suck is for you. <laughs> Sin's making a big octopus. Mm -mm. I'm going to hit you. Okay. Get that box out of the way. Over there. Okay, let's see. I got a bag. Let's see what's in the bag. I don't know. I think this might be all FOs that I made when I was there. Might be. We'll see. It's going to be a surprise. Love you, Knit Pearl Squirrel with Granny D. Thompson. Yes, we all love our Granny D. Mary Ann, she's unboxing her yarn that she's... Yeah, I had all this yarn at my son's house. I had it stashed there. Papa Swift didn't know about it. <laughs> when we after the wedding yesterday, we went by there for, you know, a little celebration. Not much. It was just the four of us. And um, so I grabbed all the stuff that I had there. So he made six trips up and down the stairs for me to the car. Oh, okay. This is FO's. I have a, this is a, a granny square sweater. Those granny sweaters, those granny shrugs. Yeah, that I made for my dog. I gotta get it to her. So, I don't know if you can see it. It's just a big granny shrug and I put sleeves on it and I kind of did a, you know, front post, back post to make the ribbing on the sleeves. No pattern, just did it. And this is the ribbing I put around the edges, front post, back post. So, yeah. True navy blue is very hard to find. It is hard to find. I like that one. The Premier Basics navy is a good blue, Madonna. I like that navy blue. Oh, okay. We got a star blanket. Got a star blanket. Maybe I'll make it bigger. And we got another star blanket. Two star blankets. I don't know what's in here. <laughs> no, we got hats I think these were going to be Billy hats because I made a bunch of little hats one Billy hat so that can go to Billy I think this is Billy's bag let's see what else oh this one's cute another Billy hat the pom poms are a little smushy <laughs> and a little square Billy hat <laughs> hi Mimi Kathy how are you honey well, I did all this while I was at my son's house. This was all being, while I was there, I just kind of sat there and did, did yarn, did crocheting. Another Billy hat with a little funny pom-pom thingy. Are they at your house? Oh, tomorrow, right, T? I think T said tomorrow. But I don't know for sure that her daughter's coming with the grandchildren. That's so exciting. Okay. And I got a scarf. Just a plain men's scarf I made. That's there. Just a plain man's scarf with a little, you know, the blue and tan. That's that. And let's see. And a purple scarf. Purple and gray. Just a plain purple and gray scarf for a man. I guess it could be for a lady too, but kind of did them with men in mind because everybody makes lady scarves. So, eh, another scarf. Let's see what else we got. Nope, oh, I had to match the scarf. I had to match the scarf. <laughs> I must have matched it to the purple and gray. I don't even remember any of this stuff. It's been so long. It's been sitting there so long. So, that's that one. Okay, what else we got? It's like a treasure trove over here. I hate littles that did as it did dance a few years back, but... I had littles that did as a dance a few years back. Sorry, I missed something, Marianne. I think I missed something. There's some more little hats that I made. They don't want, they don't want with a little ball instead of a pom-pom. Yeah. This one's just a little plain, like, Another hat, and I put like the ear flaps on it. I didn't put a pom pom or anything, I just left it plain. The little ear flaps. Little ear flap. And this is a tam. A tam that I made. You know, a tam. I'm not going to put it on because they've already been washed. So I don't want to get it dirty. But yeah, the little tam on it. Yeah, the little, the little ball. Yeah, instead of a pom pom, I tried to do something different. So. 
And I just tie them on the inside so they can take them off to wash. So yeah, it's just a little, you know, something different. So that's all the stuff that was in that bag. <laughs> this is crazy. So much stuff I didn't even remember I had. I'm sure we all have things like this. Hi, HD, how are you, honey? All right, let me put this one. I think there's a hat to match this one too somewhere. I don't know, someplace. <laughs> okay, let's move that stuff out of the way so I can get to the next one. Yeah, it's a little Yamagurumi pom-pom. Pom -pom. Yeah, it's just, you know, sometimes you just wanna, I'm sick of making pom-poms. So I try to do something a little different when I do the tops of hats that way, you know, a little bit different. All right, let's get this one out of the way and on to the next one. Okay. All right, there's a bag here. I can see through it, but let's see what's in it because I can't see it all. The lever must go pick them out. Go, 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 D. Don't worry about it. Oh, thank you, honey. No, I did those. I was there for a month, month and a half, so I just, you know, you're sitting watching TV at night and you just... Make some hats, that's all. Okay. Oh, I know what this was from. I had done an afghan. This is all leftovers from that afghan. This is, let's see, Lion Brand, hometown, USA, in Grizzlies. It's a burgundy and gray. So what I did was I had a lot, a lot, a lot of these because they were on sale for like a dollar way back when. So I bought a bunch, like 30 of them. I bought a whole big box full. And I made a weighted afghan with them. That's gone, it's gone to charity. But it, all I did was use this yarn and a, a, a smaller hook than you would normally use so it was nice and tight and it ended up real dense and real heavy and it was it came out nice, I liked it a lot. I don't know if I'd do it again because it really starts to hurt your hand after a while, but it was appreciated by the charity because they don't get, you know, nice, it was a nice warm blanket. So that's what that was from. So I have, I think five, I got five full ones and a partial left enough to do something there. Yeah. I don't know what this is. Something I started. I don't know. Any ideas? Oh, it looks like, um, this looks like that granny, kaleidoscope granny maybe? I was playing around with that, I think. I think that's what this is. But I didn't like it. I was just using scraps because the colors are yucky <laughs> together. But I was just using scraps to try it, you know. But too many ends for me. So, I don't know. I may go Play around with it again. I doubt it. We'll see. Okay, let's see. Let's see what other treasures we can find. You still at work waiting to unload? Oh, Crystal. All right, we got a couple of these. These are Cozy Wool by Loops and Threads in the color Pewter. A couple of those. I think I made a couple hats out of these at one point. There's two, so they have what? Well, let's see how many yards and stuff. They have 90 yards, and it is considered what? It's asking for a nine millimeter, so must be a six. Yeah, it looks like a six to me. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. 50% wool, 50% acrylic. So they some wool, they some wool. So I don't know. I don't know what I'll do with any of it. I'm just like, going to see what I got first. I have a burgundy. No label. Don't know. I think this might be... Oh, you know what? I think this might be one that Lynette had sent me. We had done a swap a, a long time ago. Before I had content on my channel, we did a couple of swaps. And I think this was one that Lynette had sent me. It didn't have a label on it. Oh, see all the little bits? Little bits. We save every little bit because you never know. And is a little, oh, I made a pumpkin out of this. I remember making a pumpkin out of this for my friend. I think this is um, Lion Brand something. I don't know. One of those. <laughs> and I know it's a Lion Brand, but I don't know what one. So, but it's pretty, pretty colors for a pumpkin. So, all right, let's throw that all back in that bag. <laughs> See what else we got. <laughs> oh. It's fun though. It's like getting brand new yen. I forgot it was there. So, well, I knew it was there, but I forgot what I had there. So, oh, here's another bag. Let's see. Okay, we got a red country loom, it's called, from, from um, Michael's Loops and Thread brand. Pretty color. 
pretty color. It's called Hollyhock. It's a bulky six. And it has 104 yards. It's all acrylic, I think. Yeah, 100% acrylic. Pretty one, though. It's got like a, a beige running through it. Look, it's like a boucle. I love me a boucle. It's very pretty. I like boucle yarn. I know some people don't like it at all, but I like it. So I'm happy with that. I have a ball of brown. No idea. Ball of brown. And a little skein of brown with a little yarn buff coming out of it. Because <laughs> we all have yarn buff. They don't match, though. This one's darker than this one. It's a different shades. But they're brown. Okay, I have two of these. I don't know what they are. No label. Feels like wool, though. Smells like wool. I think it's got wool in it. It might be a blend. It's pretty. I would say that's a five. And it's not very soft, so I don't know. But yeah, it looks like it's got a little bit of a, you know, the little bit of the fuzzy. Feels like it's got some wool in it or something. But I got two of those, so I don't know what I'm going to do with them. We'll see. <laughs> I like brown. I like brown and pink, too. It looked pretty together. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's stick those in that bag and go on to the next box. It's crazy. Papa Swift says, okay, I got it all in the car. Now, where are you going to put it when we get home? And I went, on your side of the bed, you can sleep in the car. <laughs> oh, okay, two more boxes. I got to get up, though, because that one's too far away. I think this one's too heavy. Oh, this is the one I had under the bed, under my son's bed. Yeah, I kept it under the bed because there was nowhere else to put it. So I just slid it under his bed. So my now daughter-in-law uh, was very glad to get rid of it all. <laughs> oh, it's heavy. It's a big one. It didn't come from Amazon. It's just in a big Amazon box. Let's see what we got. Oh my God. Holy mackerel. Okay, we got Hotland. Love me, Hotland. Oh, I love this yarn. It's so nice. We got Lion Brand Hotland in Lake Clark, it's called. It's a medium four, five ounces, 251 yards. I have three of those, I think. Looks like there's three of those. Pretty color blue. That's a pretty blue. I like that blue. Really pretty. Okay, we got Hotland in, um, let's see, it's, I can't say it right, Cuyahoga Valley, is it Cuyahoga? I think it's Cuyahoga. It's a pretty green, pretty teal, it looks like it has like a bl little bit of a black fleck going through it. Yeah, I have one, two, three. I think four of those. This one's a partial because I used it on the star blanket, I think. Yeah. Okay, let's see. One, two, and a partial. Three. Yeah, three and a partial. Three full ones and a partial. That's pretty good. This yarn is so soft, though. I love Hotland. It's such a nice soft yarn. It's one of my favorites. Okay, we got a couple. Let's see what these are. Karen Jumbo in Peacock Variegated. That's a pretty, pretty one. I like that. I got two of those. Two of those. Yep. Yep, yep. What else? Oh, my God. This is crazy. I got a Karen one pound in cream. It must have been five dollars or five ninety nine or something on sale at Joanne's because they they have a Joanne's and a Michael's right near each other right down the street from them so you know so I got <laughs> Karen one pound in cream and a Karen one pound in soft gray mix it says pretty pretty I can't believe I had all this at their house yeah isn't that teal pretty though Dina this is a pretty Pretty teal. I love Hotland. That's got to be one of my all-time favorite yarns. Love it. So soft. Okay, what else we got? Let's see. 
We got one, two, three, four, five, six of these. We got six Barcelona in Hazel. Seriously, need a Michaels and a Joanne's here. Yeah. We have too many. We have too many. I know we got to my son's wedding early yesterday, so because we didn't know about traffic, you know, so we left early. So I went on to FaceTime with T so she could see around San Diego because she doesn't get to get out. And I was like, oh, I'm going to give her a little tour. So we did a little field trip because <laughs> we had about an hour to kill. So um, what's the name of the hot land? Oh, it's Hotland, honey. I'm sorry. This one is Hotland. Lion Brand Hotland. And I don't know how you pronounce this one, but I'll show you the label. Oh, will it focus? Did it focus? Oh, it's backwards too, isn't it? It's called... It's C-A-Y... Oh, C-U-Y... A-H-O-G-A Valley. Cahoga? Cahoga Valley? Something like that. This is a really pretty great. Anyway, so back to my story with T. So we took... We took her on a little tour of downtown San Diego. We were down by the waterfront. So we showed her around like where the, the naval ship is. There's a big, big, big carrier there that's, um, hi, Milda, hi, Annie. And um, yeah, keeping it real, that's right. <laughs> that's me, Dina. <laughs> You're like lightning speed. No, I'm not. Sorry, I'll slow down. You want me to slow it down? I'm sorry. I'm just trying to keep it going because it's going to take a while. we got a whole other big box to do. <laughs> so anyway, we took, we took her downtown and so she could see some things. And it was just fun. And she got to take some pictures and stuff. So that was cool. Because her son's in the Navy. So it was nice that she got to take some pictures of things that we have here. She could send them to him. Oh, I didn't miss you. We just got home from town. Oh, hi, Linda. I'm glad you made it, honey. Okay, so back to my yacht. We got six of these in Barcelona. The color is hazel. So that's a pretty one. It's like a beige and brown mixture with some gray in there. Pretty. So I got six of those. You need to see all six. One, two. Three, four. <laughs> Five, six. These have 328 yards. They're seven ounces. I think it's all, it's 100% acrylic. I believe it is. It's a bulky five. Yeah, 100% acrylic. Yeah, it's pretty. I really like this one. So I don't know what I had in mind, but they must have been on sale too because, you know, I bought six of them. <laughs> okay, put those away. This box just got ruined, so I won't be able to use it again, but that's okay. At least I can put them for now. Okay, we got... Let me flip it around. Nope. This one. Premier. No, this is Big Twist. Big Twist. Yeah, we got Big Twist. I got one in a one in a little bit of this gray in Big Twist. This is 100 percent acrylic. Soft gray. This is Joanne House brand. Yeah. Super califragilistic expialidocious. That's what this is like. I'm sorry. Am I going way too fast? I'll try and slow down. I always speak quickly. It's bad habit, I guess. Okay, 380 yards. 100% acrylic. Big twist in soft gray. So I have one in a little bit of that one. I like the yarn. It's nice for an inexpensive acrylic, you know? I like that one. Okay, let's put those over here. Let's see what else we got. Oh, another one. Another full one in soft gray. Cool. Nice. I like to use that as a, um, a neutral in between. You're absolutely great and your energy is great, my dear. Okay, thank you. I'm sorry. I'm going too quick. I'm trying. <laughs> Okay, we got Premier Basics, which is one of my favorite acrylics, in light gray. Premier Basics is 359 yards. I took you to the outhouse with me. Did I get cold? No, I didn't get cold. It's hot in here. Laura took us to the outhouse with her. Wasn't that sweet of her? Hi, Carrie. 
Sorry if I missed you, honey. Isn't that nice of her, Melda, to take us to the outhouse? <laughs> so nice. Yeah, she's like that. She's very thoughtful, my friend, Lara. Yeah, mad Mimi. You know, she's a little mad, but we still love her. No, my sense of smell has never been... <laughs> That's what the chill was, huh, Mad Mimi? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is crazy. This is way more than I even thought I had there. So, all right, we're going to keep going. Uh, this is in soft gray. I think I have two of these in here. Yep, two gray. Two soft gray Premier Basics. 359 yards. It's a size 4, 100% acrylic. And this is one of my favorite. This and Big Twist. I mean, uh, yeah, Big Twist. Are, I think the best inexpensive acrylics. I love working with them. They're great. <laughs> Okay, let's keep going. We got three of these. Big twist value in medium gray. So we got three of those. One, two, three. Three of those. <laughs> same thing, same specs, everything. It's in medium gray. So I think I had in mind maybe doing, um, uh, what do you call it? Yeah, you know, the, the checkerboard kind of plaid. Yeah, I thought I was going to maybe do that with the light gray, the medium gray, and black and do a checkerboard for like a, you know, a masculine type Afghan to donate. That's what I think I had in mind when I bought these. I'm not sure. You never know. You never know what I, what I have in mind. All right, we got Big Twist in black because you can't have enough black. So we got two and a partial, I think. Yeah, this is a partial. So we got two in a partial of this one. Same thing. 350. Oh, these are 380 yards. Big twist. And color black. 100% acrylic. Four weight. Yep, basic stuff. Basic stuff. Yep. Okay, that's that. And what else is in this box? Oh, this is when um, Joanne had these on sale. For on clearance. And I got these. The Naco. Naco. Yeah. Um, let's see what these are. I don't even remember. They are Nako Vals, V-A-L-S. 100% premium acrylic. It looks like a two to me. I would call that a two weight. Yeah, I'd call that a two. Um... I don't see. 100 grams, 240 meters. Yeah, that's got to be a two. Yeah. It's got to be a two weight. I don't see any anything else on here. Let's see. Me. So we got a couple in the brown, a couple in the white. They're just colored numbers. They don't have names on them, I don't think. So but that's the label on it. Nako Vals. I don't know if that's backwards. Is it backwards to you? I think it might be. Yeah. All right, what did Madonna say? What are we laughing at? I have to be careful about getting cold. My head is going, what are you doing? Stop. Stop that. Okay. Um, yeah, 240 meters. I'd call that a two-weight. I don't see it on there, but yeah. I think that's a two. Pretty. So I got two, two white, two brown couple more in here. A green. Pretty green. And a burgundy. Those would make something pretty for Christmas. Something pretty for Christmas. Maybe ornaments or something. That'd be pretty. Yeah. All right. That's it for that box. The never-ending box. Do you like this? I mean, I haven't tried it yet. Yeah. Cool. Okay. All right. Let me throw all this back in there. See if I can get it all back in that box. And then we'll uh, go to the last box, which is a huge one from Hershnes, which I have no idea what's in it either. Because I don't know. I don't remember what I bought. It's cool. It's like Christmas, opening all this brand new yen. Nako is a favorite of Rosalie. Is it? Nick, uh, Rosalie likes it, Judy. I'll have to talk to her about it, see what she what she makes with it. Yeah, I'll give her, I'll send her a message and find out what she does with it. Okay, and that's that one. That's a big one. 
and I ripped it. So it's, it's of no use anymore. Those Christmas colors would look great with the ugly Christmas sweater hat. Yeah, you're right, Laura, they would. You want to make one? Are you going to make one? I'm busy. I got other things going on. I can't start another project. It's crazy. Madonna, I'm fine. Thank you, Linda. Yeah, Madonna's fine. She's always fine. Damn it. Okay, I got to stand up. I got to get the last box. I can't reach it. I'll be right back. Sorry. Okay, here we go. It's a big, big Kirshner's box. Let's see what's in it. It's a big one. It's heavy. I'm going to put it on the floor. Hopefully I don't knock you over. I'm knocking everything else over. <laughs> okay, it's on the floor. I'm going to make one if Joanne ever tells me to pick up my order. I know, Laura puts an order in with Joanne and they just never, never seem to get it to her. It's crazy. She has no luck. No luck with them. Ooh. That's just an empty bag. Put that over there. Ooh, we got 10% off. 10% off at Hershey's. I bet it expired because it's been a while. Let's see. Oh, yeah, through June 30th. Oh, it's no good. Okay. I'll throw that out. Hershey's catalog because, you know, they love to put all this stuff in here. Yeah, my packing slip, order slip, invoice. Let's see what I got here. I don't know. Got a bunch of stuff. Okay, let's see. We'll find out together. Ooh. We got some Red Hot Comfit. Red Hot Comfit. It's a four weight, 340 gram, 560 meters, 612 yards, 100% acrylic. This is the color Moss Fleck. Moss Fleck. It's pretty. I got two of those. One. Nope, got one of those. One of those. I got three. Okay, we got another Red Hot Comfit in latte fleck that one one of those they i probably got them because they would go together maybe i don't know who knows don't know. who knows why we order what we order and this is another one in teal fleck pretty colors though yeah so those three yeah they would look nice together i think so i don't know we'll see we'll see <laughs> i don't know what we Cause you forgot about yeah isn't it crazy you choose why you forget and yeah but you still love them we love them all we love it all all right we got a bunch of these let's see what this one is depart department 71 selena it is a three-way 68 acrylic 22 nylon six wool four no mo mohair 180 yards, and I don't see a color. I just see a dye lot. It's like a charcoal gray, a deep charcoal gray. I got one, two, three, four, five, six of those. Six of those. It's a pretty color. It's very soft. It says it's a three weight. I don't know. I might go four, but because of the fuzz, you know. But yeah, there's six of those. That's cool. And I mean, that would be awesome. Looking forward to it. Yeah, six of those. It's a pretty color. Pretty charcoal gray. Okay, and we have, let's see, six more in the cream, in a cream color. Let's see what this is. Same specs. Yeah, there's no color. It's just a number on it. So I would call that a deep cream. If I had to call it something, maybe I'd call it eggnog. Kind of looks like eggnog. We're going to call it eggnog. <laughs> I got six of those. <laughs> six of those. Okay, now we got six of these. Let's see what this one is. Department 71 Sienna this time. Sienna. And this one is 90% acrylic, 10 polyester. Hirschnitz. Oh, this one has a name on it. It's called Raven. 
It's got like a shiny, shiny. It's pretty. It's pretty. I think I have six of those too. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. Six of those. They're pretty. It's a pretty one. It's got all that shiny, shiny in it. I've tried. I can't. Love the sparkle. Yeah, it's pretty, huh? Okay, so there's six of those. And six more in this color. They must have been on clearance or something, because why would I buy them all up like that? They had to be on clearance. Okay, this color is olive. Olive. It's pretty though. It's got a little sparkle to it. A little shine, a little shimmer in there. Pretty. Okay, six of those. This is never ending. This box is never ending. <laughs> oh, and these are a shimmery one too. This one is called Hazel. It's Hazel! My sweet smiley friend Karen. Just like her granddaughter, Hazel. Same specs. And there's six of those in the hazel. I'm getting my hair in it. Okay. Hazel. That's pretty too. I like that one. Pretty one, pretty one. Okay, six of those. And we're back in the box. <laughs> we got. Let's see. Red Hot Amour. Red Hot Amour in midnight is that black or navy it's black i think i'm gonna open it because i can't tell i don't care yeah hazel yeah it's black okay midnight red hot amour is four weight it is 3.5 ounces 198 yards in the black so i got three of those one, two, three of those. I got three or more in the what? Earl Grey, it's called. It's a pretty gray. Earl Grey. Got three of those. These must have been on clearance too, because you know. I got three in chamomile, which is a pretty cream. I like cream. It goes with a lot of things. The so three of those. And we got three in. What's this one? This is a gray. Let's see what color. Whisper. Whisper, it's called. <laughs> it's a pretty gray. So we got. Yeah, those all look good together. Maybe I ordered them because I liked them together. <laughs> I don't know. I want to shop in your tubs. Man, we, yeah, Laura's got tons of tubs. She needs to go through too. Okay, so there's only a little bit left. A bunch of Christmas. Um, Pastry puffs. Christmas pastry puffs we got left in here. Okay. <laughs> we got six of these. Holiday pastry puffs. They must have been left over from last year. Oh, it's got a little handle. A little handle to hold the bag. All right, I'm going to open it and see what they say. Let's see. Let's see what's in there. Okay, we got... Two of this one. This one is Hershey's Holiday Pastry Puffs in Sugared Plums. There's two of that one in the bag. This one is Jewel Tones. I like that. That's pretty. There's two of that one. It must have been last year's because I got them this summer. So it must have been on clearance. Oh, this one's pretty too. This one is Cool Christmas. Cool Christmas, it's called. So there's two of that one. There's two of each. I don't know. Must have been some kind of deal they were having, because why would I order them like this at Christmas in July? I don't know. June? When did I put this in? I ordered this on... I don't know. There's no date on here. I don't know. It doesn't matter. I don't know. Sometime <laughs> late spring, early summer. Never used the pastry puffs. Let me know what you think about it. Yeah, it's pretty. The colors are pretty. 
I haven't tried it yet, so I will let you know, Lala. And one more, only one more. That's it. One more pastry puffs, holiday pastry puffs. I don't know how I'm gonna get this box out of here because it's kind of got me, got me pinned in here. <laughs> All right, let's see what these say. Okay, there are two of this one. This one is Starry Night. It's called. That one's pretty. It's pretty. Yeah, they're soft. I'd say it's a four. It's a true four. Yeah. 70% acrylic, 30% wool. Sorry, I didn't even tell you about that. Um, let's see. It doesn't have the, here's the yardage. Oh, 228 yards in each. So it's two of each color. And this one is peppermint. It's called peppermint. I like that one. That's pretty. Yeah, that one's pretty. You like the other one, Jan? The blue and yellow? And, yeah. and this is the last one. The last one is called country that one's pretty too I like that so yeah that's it all done <laughs> now I gotta figure out where the heck I'm gonna put it <laughs> I don't know hey Karen you got any room Karen's always offering a store yarn for me I have to go by Judy bye Judy thanks for coming honey you have a great night stay safe okay Karen's always willing to store yarn for me. You think she's got room for all this? I don't know where I'm going to put it. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it all out. So I did all right. It had to have all been on sale because there's no way I would have bought all this with it not being on clearance or something. So probably last year's Christmas stuff clearance. I don't know. But whatever. We'll use it. We'll use it for something. Yeah, I like these three together. I think that's why I ordered them. Cause I like all three of them together. They're different together. The colors, the red hot comfort. Yeah. Time to buy some new totes. I know. Well, Papa Swift is out in the shed making room for me. We have a shed in the back. Oh, look what he found out there when he was cleaning out the shed. He found two, <laughs> two old knitting needles. They don't match, but there's an eight and a nine. One of them is an old Sears and the other one I can't read. Oh, it's a boy. This is a boy, and this is an old Sears brand knitting needle. Can you see it? If you can see it. Right. He was going to throw them out. I said, no, no, we don't throw out things like that. We save them. Yeah. We still have to do our swap. I know. I know. All right. So that's it. That's all I got for today, for this week. I will. Well, I reckon what, Marianne? Sorry. I miss that. I've been missing the chat so I can find some room for you. You can. Thank you, Marianne. That's so sweet, honey. Throw them away. What? The knitting needles? No, 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 Madonna. I'm not throwing them away. I know you don't like them, but you don't have to look at them. It's okay. Yeah. Yeah, me too. Thank you for coming, honey. That was fun. Okay. So let's go over the Sharon, Sharon's fundraiser one more time and then I'll call it a night because we're already getting to an hour. Okay, so Sharon's fundraiser is called hashtag Our Gifts of Love. It's in my title. I have all the information in the description box. We are picking the winner on Wednesday. No, we're picking the winner on Thursday. You can buy tickets until Wednesday night, 11.59 p.m. Pacific time. Oh, thank you for coming, honey. I'm so glad you came. Tickets are $5 a piece, 5 for 20 And, um... Let's raise lots of money. If you have a channel, if you wouldn't mind, just put a little little snippet of content out there, let people know about it. The more word we can get out, the more we can get the word out, the more tickets we can sell, the more money we get for Jan. Thank you, Jan, for um, sharing. And that's all I care about. That's all this is about. So we are up to right now, $2,590, nine zero. Yeah, almost 2,600. We have 20 different prizes. It's amazing. Amazing. So, yeah. Let's get it done. Let's get it done. So we'll do the drawing on Thanksgiving Day. Live. I'm going to do it live. 3 o'clock Pacific time. So that'll be cool. There was something else I wanted to say. I can't remember. 
I can't remember anybody. Anybody remember what I wanted to say? I can't remember. I know. Oh, I have giveaway. <laughs> I have a giveaway. I have this afghan on the back of my chair and I have no room to store afghans. This is what <laughs> This is one that I made when I was at my son's house. It is a single crochet queen size chevron. I called it the beast when I was making it cuz it took forever. But it is white with a variegated red and blue and, and orange in there, cranberry in between. So it's a big one. You're going to say how much you love me. Oh, you know how much I love you, Lala. Without Lala, I couldn't go on live because she checks me for boogers to make sure I'm okay. Anyway, all right, so this is a queen size chevron. If you would like to win this afghan, don't feel obliged. If you don't want it, I won't be hurt. <laughs> I'm fine with that. I get it. I know a lot of people don't like making them and I do so I want to give them out I want to give them to people that come and watch me. So that's what I'm doing I won't stay so this week what I want you to do After this goes to replay come back after and ask me another question. That was fun One ticket for five five tickets for 20. Yes Okay, so come back after the this goes to replay and leave a comment in the comment section and ask me a question about myself again. That was fun answering questions. Just try to keep it, you know, let's not get crazy. I don't care if it's about yen or not about yen or whatever you want to ask. And what I want you to do, the keyword this week is going to be you, but E-W-E, not Y-O-U. So put the word you in there like a sheep, E-W-E, and that's the word I'll use for the filter. Okay. So just come back after it goes to replay, leave me a question and we'll do the drawing, I don't know, next week, next time, next week, next Friday, because I'm gonna go Thursday to do the um, Sharon's thing, but that won't be this, so we'll just, that's gonna take a while, because it's 20 different prizes, so that's so cool. So we'll do that on Thanksgiving, and I'll try to go live either Friday or Saturday again next weekend, and um, we'll win, we'll pick the winner for that. So thank you all for coming, thank you for joining me today, thank you for inviting me into your home, you have cool oh thank you Wanda I'm glad you like it honey yeah I have a few more so every week we'll start putting more on the chair and we'll start clearing them out because Papa slips like ah. <laughs> so this will be the giveaway for next week so the word you e w e okay and put that in you know in the question somewhere in the question that you want to know anything you want to know about me i'll try and answer everything i can okay so anyway thank you all for coming thank you for inviting me into your home it really does mean a lot i know i say it all the time but you have so many choices and that you choose to come watch me just really means the world so stay safe have a safe week if i don't see you before i'll see you on thursday i'll try to do one more update hopefully we'll get lots more in and i can do another update before thursday but thank you so much I love you all. Bye-bye.